So you might be trying to figure out how you can hide the notch on your specific MacBook Pro. Now doing this is actually very, very basic, and we can do that by using this top notch application. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and make your way over to the topnotch.app. That's basically the name of the website. I will try to leave this linked in the description, but if for some reason it's not working, topnotch.app is literally the name of the website. So when you go ahead and type in that name, you will come into this panel. Now all you want to do is you can look through it if you want to, but in this case we'll just download for free. So we're going to download this specific application and we want to click allow. Now when this file is downloaded, all you want to do is make your way over to your downloads folder and you will see that .dmg file. So all you want to do is go and double click on that file and it will basically tell you to go ahead and drag this file basically into your applications folder. So go ahead and do that. And when it's done, it'll go ahead and I'm pretty sure I just did it. You can then go ahead and boot up your applications folder and then you want to see top notch, which is right here. Now I just did that in real time. So I've, I was doing it right in front of your eyes and we're barely a minute into the video. So that's how fast you can pretty much get this done. So now what you want to do is you want to double click on top notch and you want to go and give it permission. So you want to go and click open and then it'll tell, go and tell you to agree to whatever. So just click agree and that is it. Now, when you're ready, let's go and hop out of here. You will see that on our main page, we basically have our application and everything, right? Well, if we want to, what we can do is we can go ahead and click on the top right portion up here and we can go ahead and hide the notch. So now when we want to, we can go ahead and click up here and we can go and toggle this on and watch what happens. The notch now actually goes away and that is all you're going to have to do. And when you're ready, you can go and hop out of here and that's it. You can now use the MacBook as you normally would. The notch just basically is hidden away with this black bar. So it basically looks like a normal MacBook, which is kind of cool. Now, if you want to bring that notch back, it's also very basic. All you have to do is go and click up here and turn off that notch like this, and that is it. You can now go ahead and go back to your normal way, and that's pretty much how it's done. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button on me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.